Hello guys and welcome back to The One Motorhome. Uh, this is the channel where we try to find the perfect layout, the perfect design, and basically the perfect motorhome for you. Today, really special treat for you, brand new 2023 Autosleeper Nuevo EK TB LP. Now this is built on a Fiat chassis, it's got 140 brake horsepower with a fully automatic gearbox, actually a nine speed gearbox. I'm going to show you around this van, we're going to have a look at all the features and benefits of it and then at the end, if you stay there, I'm going to be telling you my favourite part about this van. Uh, but follow me around and let's have a really good look. As usual, we'll start with the front of the motorhome. Gorgeous Fiat Ducato, lovely silver cab and the graphics swoop really nicely into the habitation. Again, it's got these kind of aeroplane graphics going all the way around. 16 inch alloys that come with this. We've got a little bit of storage inside this compartment here, which I'll show you when we get inside. And uh, just under here, this is a wet locker for keeping your cables, ramps, that sort of thing. It has got an external plug point, so you can plug in a three pin plug in here. And you've even got an external barbecue point. And that links directly to the 25 litre refillable gas tank, which is underneath. You can fill this manually with a hose and it's got a nice sized tank which I'll put up on the screen for you right now. And just moving up, let's have a look. Two lay canopy on the top there to protect you from the sun and the rain. Nice LED strip light above the habitation door. And we've got an electric step at the bottom here as well. Gorgeous, gorgeous little van. Um, the dimensions of this van, it's around 5.7 meters in length and it's around 2.3 meters in width. So really nice compact van. Great for getting around the countryside and obviously good for parking. Comes with these LED lights at the side here, really nice and modern. And we've got bike rack rails so you can clip a bike rack to the back. And obviously you've got a window at the back here and a reversing camera at the top to help you with parking. Gorgeous van, I have to say, really like these people love these vans they're a great layout and you can just zip about like i say this is where your toilet cassette lives obviously this is where you plug in it's plugged in at the moment so you can plug that in at home or on a campsite and this is where you can suck water into the vehicle so two ways of filling this either with a hose or you can use a whale pump to suck the water in as i mentioned refillable gas system so a 25 litre refillable gas tank underneath and you just go to your petrol station that sells LPG and plug it in. And also, if you're on a campsite, you can plug into a TV aerial and you've got a 12 volt system there if you wanted to have a satellite dish on the roof. Underneath the bottom, there's where you release the water from the tanks. So fresh water tank release is under here. Wastewater tank is just under there. Moving around, let's have a look inside the cab just quickly. So inside here, as I mentioned, Fiat Ducato, it's got Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, nine speed automatic gearbox. Just at the top there, you can see in replacement of the mirror, you've got an LCD screen, which will show you what's going on behind you all the time. Has got cruise control, cab air conditioning, no handbrake. So it's an electric handbrake on this. And let's have a good look round, shall we? So as I mentioned, automatic, as you guys are probably aware of, these automatics are very difficult to get hold of. So we do have this one here if you're interested. But let's have a look inside, shall we? This is the kitchen to the motorhome. You've got a big oven, big enough for a chicken, separate grill, three gas burners and an electric hot plate. Just above that, you've got a extractor fan, so a carbon extractor. Now it does run hot and cold water in here and it's got a heating system which runs from gas and electric as well. So you can be fully self-sufficient in here. Above this area, plenty of storage for in the kitchen. And just here, this is actually a, a part of your Wi-Fi aerial. So it does have a Wi-Fi aerial on the roof and that's great if you like to do a lot of work from home. Just beneath, just to show you the storage in here, we've got a little bit underneath the sink. Then you've got a nice compartment in there, big cupboard, and then we've got three drawers, one for your cutlery, another one here, and another one at the bottom. 
just to let you know, this does come with all its own plates and bowls and things like that. Also, it comes with a hookup cable with it. Um, so it comes ready to go. It has got an 80 watt solar panel on the roof and you can see how all that's working on your control panel here. So at the moment, obviously we're, we're inside, so it's not drawing any solar current, uh, but we are plugged in. So it's showing you that we're on a mains current and it's showing you how the vehicle battery and the leisure battery are doing. Also, you can see your fresh water, your wastewater levels um, and do various other th things with this control panel. So that's great. Um, also, this is where you control your heating. Uh, it's saying at the moment it's 13, 14 degrees in here, but we don't have the heating on. Um, but as I mentioned, you can run that from gas and electric. All the windows have got nice blackout blinds on them. So there's plenty of privacy in here. Um, so blackout blind on the way up and a fly screen on the way down. So that's really nice. Keeping with the kitchen theme, we've got a nice size microwave and that's a plateless microwave. So that won't rattle around as you're driving. And there they are, the famous auto sleeper crystal glasses. Underneath, we've got a three way fridge so that will run from gas, electric or the leisure battery. Um, we've got plenty of work surface. So if you like to do your cooking, there's plenty of space in here. One thing I'll say about this vehicle. Now, you've got to remember this is less than six meters. So a six meter van with all of this in it. Yet it feels very spacious and check out the lighting in here. I mean, it looks fantastic. We're indoors um outside's quite dark there's a few lights out there but this is fantastic it's amazing just up on top we've got touch sensitive lights so touch on touch off which are really really nice and obviously you can adjust the light on that so you can turn that up and down for your toilet and bathroom facilities you've got an electric flush toilet um toilet roll holder down here towel holder toothbrush holder little cupboard in here for keeping bits and bobs and then to the right you've got somewhere to keep your shower gel sink for washing your hands doing your teeth and of course a shower with a shower head up there just here this is very clever see if i can do it pull that out like that that pulls out and it's actually a big washing line for the toilet shower room so you can dry your towels and your clothes and remember, you can blast hot air in here as well. Now, cleverly, a lot of people like a separate toilet shower. So what you can do is pull this round. So that basically makes that a shower cubicle. And then in here, let me see if I can do this for you. Then you can pull that round like that. So actually, it's completely enclosed and you've got a lovely shower. So the toilet's not going to get wet. The sink's not going to get wet. And yeah, really good design. I have to say, Auto Sleeper are uh, one of the best in the UK at making motorhomes. They've been going for a long, long time. And this one doesn't disappoint. Just in here, obviously, mirror for getting ready. But inside this cupboard, you've got a big table which you can use either indoors or outdoors. Uh, another cocktail table which you can use at the front in the cab. So if you've just got the captain seat spun around then you've got a table you can just have a cup of tea or a, a bite to eat obviously you can hang your clothes in here and it has got a max view booster so it's got a tv aerial on the roof of this and a wi-fi aerial so in the front part of the motorhome you've got these opposing sofas which are really comfortable nice color and they will pull out into either a really nice size double bed which I'll give you the dimensions of on the screen, or you can use the driver's seat and the passenger seat and incorporate that in with this and have these as two single beds. So if you don't like jumping over one another uh, to get to the loo at night, then this is ideal if you're looking for something compact. Plate rack, wine holder, lots and lots of space in these and going with the storage theme i mean there's so much room in this i have to say just to show you underneath here so this bench seat here you can lift it up now i'm not sure if it's got stuff in it at the moment but let's lift it so i can show you yeah so it's got some bits and bobs in there at the moment which obviously come with the van the plates and whatnot but in there you can actually access that from outside 
So there's a big bit of storage underneath that one. And let's see if we can have a look in this one as well. There we go. Loads of storage under there as well. At the moment, the carpets are all wrapped up under there. Um, but obviously when they're out, that's a huge amount of storage. Up top on the other side, again, you've got cupboards, space either side, um, and huge skylights running all the way down the vehicle. So what do you think of this then? Under six meters, Fiat Ducato, automatic, gorgeous cab, nine speed, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, reversing camera. What more do you want? <laughs> While I'm thinking about it, let's go through a few of the extras. So external barbecue point, external plug point, refillable gas bottle, so 25 litre gas bottle. Uh, the length is around 5.75 meters, so that's around 18 foot 10. And the width with the mirrors folded is around 2.3 meters, which is around seven foot seven. Uh, overall height of the vehicle, uh, 2.9 meters, so nine foot six. And the internal height, really nice. It is 1.96 meters or six foot five. So you're gonna have to be pretty tall to bang your head on the roof of this. Um, it's a three and a half ton chassis, so you can drive it on any license. Freshwater tank over 100 litres, wastewater tank over 70 litres. Um, it's got an online portal to remotely manage and locate the vehicle, and that's via the new Truma uh, control panel that we were looking at earlier on. Uh, 80 watt solar panel. Uh, the front double bed is 2.1 metres by around three, sorry, 2.1 metres by around 1.4 metres, which is six foot 11 by four foot six, so really nice size. Comes with an Av Avtex 19.5 inch flat screen TV, which is a 12 volt television and a detachable soundbar. So that comes with this vehicle. You've got lots of plug points. So you've got four 230 uh, sockets, uh, two 12 volt sockets. Um, and I mean, the list goes on with this. You've got the whale auto fill and separate manual filler uh, for the fresh water tank, drive safe regulator. The list goes on and on and on. Now, if you've fallen in love with this vehicle as much as I have, and I know you have, this is a great van. Automatic, very, very rare, difficult to get hold of. I believe there's around a year or a year and a half waiting list to get this if you were to order it. However, we have got this in stock here in Choose Leisure Motorhome. So if you want it, pick up the phone call, Choose Leisure Limited, and we will look after you. Also, if you want to come and see us, we'll be at the NEC show in February in Birmingham. So do come up to the Auto Sleeper stand. Uh, we've got just about every model of Auto Sleeper in stock at the moment. So there's no waiting around for orders. You can put your name down and we can get you the van within a couple of weeks. So that is a very, very big privilege at the moment, considering the huge waiting list. Um, as normal, if you like the videos, do click the thumbs up. If you've got questions, leave a comment. And of course, if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. So click the subscribe button, press the little bell icon and you'll get updates of all the videos that I do. And I normally do a video every one or two days. So, well, in fact, probably about two a week. So two a week. And also there's lots more videos to catch up on as well on the channel. So we've done lots of videos on there. Um, hopefully, we're close to finding the perfect van for you. My favorite part about this vehicle is the automatic gearbox and how compact it is so you can drive it around those country lanes and actually park it. I'll see you guys soon.